India's first EV sports bike. Hi guys and welcome back to Bike with Girl. Uh, finally, we have an electric sports bike in India. This is the F77 by Ultraviolet. And if you remember, I had this concept in 2019. And here we are with the fully loaded motorcycle in 2022. It has just launched and here I am with it. Okay, so for starters, the F77 has always looked futuristic. Even when I rode it back in 2019, I was like, wow, this has such a sci-fi-ish look to it. When you start off from the front, it's got a nice, like it looks almost like a naked motorcycle face. But then you go to the side and you're like, holy shit, what happened here? Because it's completely beefed up and this whole thing has just changed up. Uh, and then you have this whole sports bike illusion happening for you. Uh, I'm going to quickly... Ooh, that's interesting. It's, it's kind of tiny, the TFT, but let it, let it open up. I was just noticing something very, very different about this motorcycle. So if you come close, you're not going to see even one nut, bolt, screw on this bike at all. They've made sure that all those <laughs> are hidden away. And I think that makes it very, very cool. Because to do that is not easy. That is one hot tail. I really think so. Ultraviolet claims that this is a whole 207 kg. So that means that it has gained more weight from the last time. Uh, but we are going to see what else has changed on this. It's definitely got wider handlebars going on right over here. Uh, so Ultraviolet also claims that they have raised up the handlebar as opposed to other sports bikes. Which I'm trying to figure out but I can't really because I'm not riding this bike. This is just me looking around at the bike at this point. We will know more when I ride this in December and I'm really waiting for that because I got damn excited when I rode this the last time. Okay, let's open this and see what this is. Ooh, nice. A, a very nice, neat area for the charging port. Where you just put the, it, it charges almost like your phone. You just put this in here and woo, charging ho gaya. Now, one of the main controversies when it comes to EVs in India is the battery, right? So now when it comes to this particular battery, this is running an SRB10 battery. And that makes it the largest battery pack on an EV motorcycle slash scooter in India, which is, which is pretty cool. Uh, now, Ultraviolet claims that this will give you about 307 kilometers uh, on one charge, which is almost like a tank of fuel, I'm guessing. So it gets three riding modes. Yeah. Itane log kaas Get out of my train. This is still mine. Uh, there is glide, there is combat, and there is ballistic. Safe to say I will always be in ballistic because you know me. Uh, apart from that, I look at the display, the buttons don't seem very, they seem a little heavy handed unfortunately. But again, we're not riding it today so I can't really say much about the fit and finish of the bike. And yeah, that's about it. Okay, uh, now coming to the very most important part of this video which is the pricing. Uh, this is the recon and the price of this is 4.5 lakhs X showroom. Um, what do you think of the pricing? Please do tell me in comments. Uh, this is the higher, like the higher end version of what they are offering. There's also the OG Ultraviolet uh, F77, which is 3.8 lakhs X showroom, which I think is pretty well priced. You get a smaller battery uh, pack on that. And uh, also you will get lesser range and fewer features. But 3.8 lakhs is really not bad. Uh, and deliveries are to start in India uh, by about end of Jan. So yeah, that's all the information I have for you today. We will be riding this bike sometime in, I'm thinking December. And uh, 
once i write it i will come to you with the right review but if you have any other questions tell me in comments and i will try and find out from the manufacturer and get back to you what do you think of this kick ass looking motorcycle i would really like to know from you guys in comments uh anyway uh, do like subscribe share and jo bhi karna hai kar lo and i will see you later